Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Malt. So happy to be here with you guys today. Really, really am. Um, first off, I just want to thank you guys so much for all of y'all's support. You know, um, it, it's, it's hard doing YouTube sometimes, but with a fan base like y'all's, it's absolutely amazing. Um, I remember when I first started trying to grow my channel, it was really, really, really hard. And um, sometimes I want to give back to other people who are trying to start channels because they love it and they are just genuinely enjoying it. Um, so shout out to Extreme Games, guys. I want you all to check them out. It's these two brothers are really cool. Check out the top of the description. There's a link uh, in the description for them. Let's see if we can get them a couple thousand subs, guys. Head over there uh, to their channel. But today we are going to be going over some Dark Elixir raids, guys. I had one of the biggest Dark Elixir raids on this account ever the other day. And I cannot wait to show it to you guys, so let's go ahead and jump into this thing. Woo! I'm super stoked. Alright guys, so here's the raid against Kaiwan Mint. Look at this guy's base. And um, the way that I went about it was, so I dropped all my loons off at the bottom. I dropped off the heal spell at first because that wizard tower was there. And wizards wreck loons. So, we dropped those off. We dropped all the loons in the same spot because I just wanted them to go straight into that dark elixir and crush it. He has a level 12 queen, which is going to do some work to us. But it's alright because we've got that Rage spell in there. The loons are taking a lot of damage, but they're also destroying a lot. Look at that. The loons themselves just got me over 2,000 Dark Elixir, guys. That's absolutely ridiculous. So we're sending in the rest of our uh, minions around the side as well. The loons are still doing good. A, a lot of them are still up. And we've got these minions over here on the right right here working on these buildings. We've still got a couple we can deploy and they're definitely going to head in there towards that Dark Elixir for us in just a little bit. Uh, these other loons right here just took out that Wizard Tower. They're still working their way around now. A lot of the loot, guys, is in uh, this right here. If you, if you looked earlier, you would have seen how low level or how, how little health the storage had. Look at this. They're going after it, guys. And we get all of it right there. Boom. Zero left. 4,200 Dark Elixir. I dropped my king off just in case the minions weren't going to be able to make it, so he's just doing his own thing over here, hitting on the wall, having a good time, and uh, yeah, that's it, guys. I was super stoked when I found that. I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to do it. Just use his ability as kind of a send-off to the base. Uh, Kaiwan Mayint, thank you so much for all the Dark Elixir, buddy. I really appreciate it. I'm going to show you guys one more replay, and then we've got a live Looney and attack for y'all as well, all right? All right, guys, so here's another one for you guys against Matafaka. <laughs> I feel like I've attacked this guy before, haven't I? I seriously feel like I've attacked this guy before. I don't know, though. From Clan Peter, we're heading in towards his Dark Elixir, guys. He's got 1,500 of it. Still a good amount. Anytime I see 1,500, I'm stoked. I'm super stoked about 1,500. This raid was actually before that 4,000 one, so I was like, yeah, I'm doing good. 1,500, let's go find some more. And then I found that one with 4,000, and I was like, you've got to be kidding me. But... We completely cleared out this side of the base, sending our minions in. They're going to go and take all of that away for us. Uh, you can see them working on it right now. Woo! Yes! I love Dark Elixir. I love Dark Elixir so much. These minions just got the rest of it down there. We don't even have to finish this thing, but I let them go ahead, take out the town hall. Um, I'm trying to figure out a good area to farm, guys, and I need to just get on for two hours and play. So often I'll get on, raid like twice, record... Um, edit, all that kind of stuff, and then I get on and what I just raided was stolen. So that's why I'm losing a lot of elixir right now. Uh, so I need to just get on, grind it out for like two hours, boost my barracks, go after it, use Barch. Um, I probably need to get up into the 1600 range. Uh, I've heard that that's a good area. If you guys know of a good area to farm with Barch, let me know down below. But we've got a full army camp. We've got full spells, I believe. Yes, full spells. So let's go ahead and jump into this thing, all right? Alright guys, so we are going to attack this base. Look, he's upgrading all three of his mortars down here at one time. I wish he was upgrading all three of his air defenses at one time. That would have been epic. But he's got a good amount of elixir, a good amount of dark elixir as well. So we're actually going to drop off down here at the bottom, guys, and just come in on this guy's base. His air sweeper is facing the wrong way. Let's go ahead and just drop a heal spell right here and let those balloons get up in there, go through that as they head towards that air defense. Come on, guys. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. And we're going to raid that right there. And then we're going to drop another... Where are they going? Where are you got? No! Why would they go that way? That doesn't even make any sense. We got to heal them up. They just took a lot of damage from something. Goodness. All right. So they're healed back up. They should make their way around. I don't know why they didn't head over towards that other air defense, but whatever. Uh, we'll go ahead and let's take this out. And let's see if we can get our king up in there. No, king. Why would you go that way? That doesn't make any sense. 
All right, so our loons are still working their way around. Uh, they're gonna take out that wizard tower. If I'd, I should have saved a rage spell over there um, and, and paid attention to the fact that there were just ground defenses left. What is our king doing besides being dumb? All right, we're gonna drop off all of our minions now over here and let them just go to town. Hopefully they will get in there, go after all of that loot for us. Uh, we're still watching our king's health a little bit, making sure that he doesn't go down too quick. There goes, oh no, the air mine. We're gonna use our king's ability now. That air mine just did a lot of work on us next to that dark elixir. Come on, head to the dark elixir. Go for it, go for the dark elixir. Go for the dark elixir. All right, good, some of them are going for the dark elixir. Oh no, but there's an air defense on them too. Dang it, guys. All right, well, anyways, we got a good amount of the elixir. It was over. There was over 200,000 of it. I don't know what our loons did. They didn't do what we wanted them to. We got the two-star. We'll go ahead and end that right there. Save some of our king's health. Ugh, not that good, guys. Not that good of an attack. 187,000. Um, what the heck happened? Something happened at the bottom where we lost a whole bunch of health. I want to go and replay that real quick and see exactly what happened down here on the bottom corner. Um, look at that. I thought I could have sworn that they would go from right over here over to that cannon and then up to that air defense But for some reason they didn't they headed in right here um, And that messed us up, but then they head right over here. Yep So it was a wow it was double air bombs It took all of them out and it did so much damage. I was dumb. I rushed the, the spell placement Don't freak out and drop your spells when you don't need to guys because as you can see there wasn't any more There was a cannon and then that archer that could have done damage to them so they would have been fine if I hadn't rushed that and I'd saved it for up here, then we would have made ourselves a way around the base and would have been able to get the rest of that elixir and dark elixir. But that is going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. I'm definitely going to be grinding out with Barch. Again, make sure that you all comment down below uh, what area you think that I should farm in. Also, guys, make sure you all check out Extreme Games again. Uh, they're linked to me in the description. Just a couple cool guys that I thought deserved a shout out. So, uh, yeah. But that's going to be it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like on the video if you did enjoy that 4,000 Dark Elixir raid. Woo! That was epic. That was so clutch. But, anyways, that's going to be it. As I said like six times now. Thank you so much, guys. Make sure you keep calm and you clash on. I'll see you on the next episode, alright? Peace.